Welcome back to my Fox 10. I hope you had a wonderful Sunday and got some time to really relax and watch some of the football out there. How about the Colts? They really did a good job in Sports 10's. John Tim will be talking about them in just a bit. Hey, the rain and the storms are gone. They are out of here. We aren't worrying about that. Uh, it did leave a little bit of a mark, though. Yesterday, over the last 24 hours, you can see Paris got a good amount of precipitation right here in Terre Haute, just shy of two tenths of an inch. Here at the station, we had about 1.3, so not that much, but still enough to get the ground wet and bring some more precipitation in there. With those storms, too, how about this photo that was sent in from Brent Barbie? I believe this was out in Riley catching the lightning, a gorgeous shot there. We did have that severe thunderstorm warning that passed through yesterday, and that did bring in quite the lightning show. But as we look at the wide view here, that is out of the picture. We aren't worrying about that moisture is traveling off to the east. We're seeing a few clouds that's passing on through now, but high pressure is sliding in and what that is going to do. It's going to kick those clouds out of here and leave us with a lot of sunshine as we head into tomorrow and into tomorrow morning. Here's a look at the wind. We do have a breeze out of the west right around 5 miles per hour. You can see most of it, though, is running out of the northwest around 5 miles per hour. Today we had gust all the way up into the mid 20s. So if you're outdoors doing any kind of yard work, some of those leaves are starting to fall off the trees. You might have been blown around just a little bit. Our current temperature is right around 56 degrees. That's actually the low for today for our Sunday. It was 64 degrees this morning, now 56 degrees. So it's cooling off. As we head into the overnight hours, we'll track this through the future cast. A few clouds passing through as we get into tomorrow morning for your commute. Uh, nothing to worry about here, not at all. Like I said, that high pressure will be moving in. We won't have to worry about uh, much from Rockville all the way down to Vincennes, the Florida, to Bloomington. A very nice afternoon in store for us, though temperatures only reaching the upper 60s as we head into tomorrow. Our average for this time of the year is actually the upper 70s. Get that, 79 degrees, so we are below that 80 degree mark now. So we were talking about fall that does move on in officially at 1029 tomorrow night. Our average high around that time is 79 degrees. Like I said, 52 degrees is usually our low. We'll be somewhere in the 60s and even cooler than that at night. So tonight right around 46 degrees, a few clouds out there. Cooler temperatures are in store. We do have that wind out of the north still running around 5 to 10 miles per hour. Tomorrow a high of 68 degrees, sunny and dry, and it's going to feel like fall. And guess what? Well, we know falls moving in. Look at this though, Monday, Wednesday through Friday, very nice conditions. Temperatures in the 70s, 74 degrees on Wednesday. Thursday, 77, 78 on Friday. I want to say that's a pretty gorgeous work week in store for us, but a low of only 42 degrees on Tuesday, so it's going to be pretty chilly for the morning hours. Not tracking any rain until Sunday.